Hello, welcome back to V93FM.com, the Sandwich Islands Network Radio. Uncle Dan Lagronio is in the house. Yes, sir, I'm right here. Looking quite spiffy this morning, man. No, oh, thank you. Uh, thank I, I you. mean, I mean, it, did you do anything special? Because it seems to me that there's cert- a certain perkiness that's going on. I, I took my meds this Oh, you took your meds. Yeah. Okay, all right. Now, somebody whose meds already has kicked in, <laughs> somebody whose meds has already kicked in is Uncle Clinton Lee. What's up, Clinton? No, he didn't kick in yet. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a big cup of, uh, I don't know if it's Kona coffee or Kamoela coffee or Kawaii coffee. Or... You'll never know. <laughs> we'll never know, but long as it, if it works, right? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I feel good. Good. Yeah. You, I, look, you I even, look good. I even washed my shirt today. <laughs> well. Oh, wait a minute. That's yes, I did. Oh, you know what? Coming all the way in from Las Vegas, Nevada, is our, our good friend, uh, Wally Tavares. Cousin Wally, good morning. Oh, good, morning. Hey, good, good morning. morning. Good morning. Hey, on the phone is uh, it's really a good friend of mine. Uh, we've known each other for a number of years uh, from back in the Aina. Um, he's living now here in Southern California, and we appreciate him calling into Simon John Network Radio this morning to talk about um, a show that's coming up. Fred um, is a, a guitar um, artist, a guitar player extraordinaire. I don't know how to describe oh, the magic you do, Fred. I don't know about that, bro. You're too kind. Bro. No, man. <laughs> um, listen, um, the show that you put on last month at the Hong Kong Gardens in Torrance, uh, people came out of the woodwork, my friend, to enjoy oh, um, your music. That's sweet, man. That's, um, nice, that's nice to hear. And I think the amazing thing is, and you and I talked about that later, I was saying that, you know, um, and that's not necessarily going to be a, a permanent thing. But right now, you don't have a CD that's out. You're not gigging any place on a regular basis. Yet we had this show, and people just flocked to uh, the showroom to enjoy the Fred Schroeder's project. Man, it was amazing. Well, yeah, it was fun. You know, I mean, I had a great time and played originals. And you know, the whole thing about this is just making people, you know, laugh, smile, cry scared i had one guy that said he was real scared when a certain piece came on and it just i love that kind of uh you know feedback from people you know i just love playing music and that's about it you know you're kind of scary talented freddie that's that's what that's all about no no no, no. <laughs> you're too kind, brother. i mean we all, you know we, we all do we do we all play and we try to get better and don't rely on our laurels like you and we just you know learn and move on and, and play and pray eh? you know <laughs> yeah so fred you know i track you back to um the um the late 70s, mid to late 70s, Spin Drifter, yeah. Hawaii, out in Kahala Mall with a group called Music Magic with Al yeah, Pasqua, man. Jay Molina, and you up front with uh, amazing guitar. Fast forward more than 30 years, uh, 11 years with uh, Hiroshima and uh, yeah. touring and traveling around the globe with your guitar, man. Um, uh, and, and here you are now, uh, you know, in, in Los Angeles and people uh, remember and appreciate uh, the the music that you do. Tell us about the Fred Shooters Project. Well, it's a whole thing about, you know, I just love to, uh, you know, my own music, and I have so many pieces, and, you know, like over, got over at least about 100, and, um, you know, I just write, you know, and all my songs have stories to them. I don't feel that, you know, writing a song just because a throwaway song, everything means something. When I was in Switzerland playing the Montreal Jazz Festival, I wrote something about that, you know. When my dad, on his, on his deathbed, I wrote a song about that, you know, uh, about in Germany, the Nazi concentration, I wrote about that. And people that hear it, they can actually visually see the soundscape that I'm, what we're trying to produce with the band. I'm working with a bass player that I worked with a long time ago. His name is David Nguyen, phenomenal bass player. He reads me like a book, you know. And so this project basically is me getting different people to play interject music and 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 different kind of freestyle kind of stuff i don't like to put a limit on i'm not a fusion guitar player i'm not a jazz guitar player i'm not a country guitar player i'm not a rock i play funk i can do all those things but it all encompasses into my music you know and i and i love that you know so um it's a project i do once every two months and um usually at the end of the month and it's at the hong kong garden in carson and it's centrally located, and we just uh, have fun. I have great players playing. It's only beginning, so who knows the players we want to have in a, a few months, you know? And since I play with so many other players that I, I mean, I'm, I mean, at the end of the month, not to not to, not to show a, not to throw a, a, a pot out there, but I'm going to play with Patty Austin and Dave Benoit in Jakarta in in a month. And tomorrow, I mean Monday, I'm leaving to play with Brother Nolan in Hawaii at the at the uh, the Blue Note, you know, in Outrigger. So 
you know, I got a lot of stuff going on, and this project encompasses that. You know, I play a lot of different kinds of, of music in there, not specific jazz, not smooth jazz. It's not. I mean, you heard it. It's not really. Um, it's not really a rock, although I do touch upon that too. So, it's a project that's going to be motivating and gradually going tornado as it starts going you know <laughs> like and the... hopefully we can get some more stuff going out of it so it's kind of neat you know i like what but you I say going you, tornado you, you take an interest in it bro i really appreciate you taking interest in you know absolutely um fred and so um you know the um, ohana club room at the hong kong gardens in torrance california is going to be the place uh for uh, your music and uh, the Fred Shooters project, and you've got Dave right. Mini on bass, and you've got um, a great vocalist that's going to be coming on board, right? Yeah, I mean Kamaya Kamaya Stewart, and she's unbelievable, man. I mean, she tears the house on. She was with Hiroshima for about five or six years. She has a lot of things on her own, but she's again, she's like a jazz R and B singer that really pulls some strings, and she make you makes you visualize certain things when you, when you know perform with her. You know, she's, sure. A beautiful woman, and and uh, and she just sings great. And uh, the drummer I got is, you know, Suzanne Morissette, who's a phenomenal, you know, woman. I think women there should be more women musicians. I'm sure there are because they make such great musicians. You know, they're, they, you know, they're just they just are. And and she just knows how to hit the drum and the right subdivisions on the drum. You know, about time, the whole musical essence thing, listening and and playing and adding her own thing. So it's really kind of cool, you know? So Fred, you've got a great combination of musicians that are going to be joining you on the Fred Shooters yeah. Project. So that's coming up uh, September uh, 30th. 30th. Um, it's, right. a, it's a Saturday. And um, you right. know, tickets are available um, uh, online right. at uh, Fred Shooters dot eventbrite dot com eventbrite nice. b r i t e they're already available and so for our listeners uh, want to experience a special brand of music it really defies definition really you're absolutely correct it's not really peg hole in any particular genre if you will no. but if we can put it in a calabash um, and it was a Fred Shooter's calabash you look inside the calabash and it just says this music is amazing. So, oh, uh, thank you, brother. Absolutely, much come up. Absolutely. So, um, if you just much. tuned in, um, we're listening to or we're talking with uh, Fred Shooters of the Fred Shooters Project um, for the um, uh, event that's coming up on September 30th at the Hong Kong Gardens at um, the Ohana Club Room. Once again, Fred Shooters, Fred Shooters dot Eventbrite dot com or Simon John Network Facebook page, Kamaka Brown Facebook page. Uh, we also have it on alohaworld.com on mainland events, and you'll see all the um, details about the various event, uh, individuals that are going to be joining Fred on the Fred Shooters Project. You know what? Now will be a really great time for our listeners to enjoy. Uh... Aloha, welcome back to v93fm.com, the Sandwich Islands Network.